Do you wish that in your real-time strategies, instead of battling robots and, you know, dudes in armor and stuff, you could instead fight, I don't know, a tidal wave of aliens sick? Well, you've come to the right place. This is Creeper World 3 Arc Eternal. Never played the first two, didn't even know they existed until recently, and it's a very odd take on the real-time strategy. I'll show you what I mean by carrying on the plot. Right, I've got two levels here I haven't done yet. I've checked them both to work out which one I want to cover in the video, and I decided to do both, because they both do different things. We're going to start on this little one down here. Oh, I should click start on it, shouldn't I? That's how we start things, and restart from the beginning. From the beginning. This is Creeper World, or one of the Creeper... Actually, that's the wrong title, isn't it? Because the Creeper's on lots of worlds. This stuff here is the terrifying Creeper Gubbins. It's quite nasty. Uh, right, this is your command thing. You put it anywhere. Actually, we won't put it anywhere yet. What we need to learn is this bit down here. This is the wildly important meter because this tells you the height of the bit the mouse is currently over. So the grey bit down there is a level 1. This is a level 2. These silvery things oh, are a level 7. This thing here is a level 3. So that goes up there and these are higher than it. That's very important. What about this bit here? That's a 1 surrounded by a 10 and some 7. Okie dokie. So that there is like a volcano with a crater in it. And this is a flat terrain area. Now, pretty soon this thing here, this thing here, and this thing here are all going to start kicking out alien vomit. And you have to fight the alien vomit using energy and guns and things. Let's break down our command center. I'm going to put the command center down here. Because even though that's on the same level as that thing, as this goo's going to come out. It has a little bit extra protection here so we can limit our fire. So that's going to go down there like that uh, and then I'm gonna build a constructor now these things collectors are these absorb uh, energy from the area see that little area there that's gonna take all the energy from that area energy is how you fire and make new things and etc etc it's your it's your main resource is energy so this thing absorbs energy but only on the level it's on so if I were to put it here you can all see all that red stuff I ain't gonna get anything from there so on more uh, levels where the terrain is a bit more interesting, things go strange. I will now unpause the game to drop my thing. And immediately, this one has fired off. This is the alien goo, what's coming at you live. And I'm going to slowly construct these things. So this thing sends out, like, pulses. And these pulses, if they're white, build. If they're red, are ammo. Uh, and this stuff, this goo just is relentless, and it's going to just keep on coming at me. So I'm going to build another few. I've got a... a a little bit of time before that can actually splooge up because that's going to go in there and it's not going to then push up on the wall too hard I don't think. I'm going to try and collect this thing here because this thing here is a new weapon and new weapons are useful. Uh, also as you can see as well as collecting all the energy we are creating lines and the lines are doing useful things. I've collected a strafer. Hang on. Pause so I can see what the strafer does. Uh, strafers are remote strike aircraft. So I've only... How many missions do I do this? Five, six? Somewhere along that so I'm still unlocking the bits as I go. Now, right strike aircraft. Build four strafers and target two at each volcano. Single click to create circle strafe attack pattern. Click and drag to define the straight line of attack. Straight line of attack. I don't know what any of that means. They're really expensive, so I won't go for that yet. But they're going to... Oh, no, 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 no. I've just noticed the volcanoes are filling up as well. Okay, good. Well, we'll deal with that in a moment. We'll, we'll, we'll sort them out. First, I want to make sure my base doesn't explode. That's my first step. So I'm going to build a gun turret here. Now... The red is where it will not be able to see. Then there's a no line of fire. So the closer I get it to the goo, the more goo it can shoot. But of course, the closer I get it to the goo, the more goo that can rise up and eat it. But I should be okay having that sort of there for now. I think I've got enough energy for two. We will see. So we're going to pump some stuff out to collect those. I really should try and get more collectors. You really do want quite a bit more energy than I've built so far. Energy there, energy there. And they all must be connected, otherwise they cannot build... Ooh, it's an odd little bit of terrain around here. Boom, boom, boom. Right, they are starting to fire quite nicely. Uh, up here you can see that I am losing energy with quite a huge, huge, alarming maneuver. But I'm building new energy things. Yeah, building is what takes up most of your energy. Actually, I'd quite like to defend this from the back as well. But I'd quite like to do it from the ground. If I could build that before the goo gets to it, then we'll actually maybe be able to hold that. Build quickly, build quickly, build quickly, build quickly. Also, we may not. Uh, I'm also going to start building reactors. Now, reactors don't need a particularly large area to build in. They just need a little area. They don't actually kick any... They don't, like, need... They don't make an area around there. They just give you power. Uh, about twice as much as one of these with a max area, I believe. Maybe a little bit more. Uh, however, they do take quite a lot to build. So if I were to build two at a time, you'll see that this energy that I'm taking up slowly creeps up. 
And if I was to build another one, it's going to creep up above, and now I'm getting a little bit too much, and now the energy's going negative. Okay, we are holding this quite nicely here. I've got to be careful, because I've got to kind of follow this one around. This is a really weird map. Um, okay, we're going to have another cannon here to defend these two entry points, and then we'll have one at the top there to defend those energy points. Now wait for these two to finish. Good, and then that should start to come down. Good, that's come down. We'll then build some more of this guff. Okay. So, the volcanoes have started to splooge out. That's never good. These are keys to other levels. We need these to get to the next levels. This thing up here is an ore. It'll let us fire one special type of weapon that we don't have yet. Okay, we're doing alright for energy. I'm going to stick another cannon down here. Not a huge amount of fire space, but I'm kind of just trying to... Fend I'm trying to hold the line at the moment while I get myself all together. Uh, right, let's get more reactors in the place. So yeah, this is a real-time strategy where every single time the enemy will behave in exactly the same way, and that way is it will just slowly flob towards you. Which I find quite interesting. I'm going to cancel one of those just to try and bring my energy back up. Because I don't want to suddenly not be able to fire. That would make me sad. Good grief. See, it's a tidal wave. So this bit coming up here is much higher, so we've got to keep that bit off of us. It's probably a good time... Oh, I don't have enough reactors. It's a good time to start building mortars. Mortars are good for depth. They're good at getting depth going on. These is up here are just kind of holding. There's nothing really for them to fight yet. And I'm genuinely quite worried about this wave of puke that's coming at me that is definitely going to do an incredibly large amount of damage. Um, so far the game's been pretty nicely balanced for difficulty. It's taught me everything properly. Much better than I've taught you. But I'm just worried that it's going to really ramp up. I have no idea how long it is. It could ramp up a lot. I'm going to risk a mortar here as our main lines of defense. So mortars don't have a line of sight. They just fire wherever the hell they want. Also, we got relays. I haven't built a relay yet, so I'm going to build a relay there. A relay, as you can see, gets the information, gets the bits down faster. So if we restock uh, once that's built, you'll see that most things now go through the relay as it's a quicker mode of transportation. Better for building, better for getting your ammo in. Very, very, very useful. As you can see there, that is now nine deep with water. Oh, there goes the mortar. Boom. So you can see the mortar's actually taking a big well out of everything. It's delightful. That's doing a wonderful job. This is holding quite nicely. I kind of would like to keep maybe this line in green. So let's... While it's extending slowly up here, and we're not really spending a lot, I'm going to just kind of take over this whole area here. I don't. You don't have to be super efficient where you place things. Uh, yet. <laughs> Maybe later in the game you will absolutely have to, but right now you can sort of wang things down. I'm going to put an ore mine on there so we can start mining ore. Now the ore has appeared on the top. Okay. I definitely, definitely, definitely need to get a cannon up here quickly. And to get stuff up there quicker, I'm going to relay... Where's the main base? Relay there. Relay point there. Relay point there. Relay point there. And then one there. Don't know if we're going to need to relay stuff all the way up there, but we're going to try. Right, so yeah, the relay, boop, 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 working nicely. Right, we started firing from there, so we've got that bit defended. And I'll have another cannon. I have one right in the way, but I'm also going to have one up here. Just in case... Oh, because I've realised things are going to spill over. That's going to actually start causing me a huge amount of problems. Because it's coming at a height. Which I don't think is something that's really happened before in all the levels I've been playing this. It's all been filling up holes and then yelling at me. But we are now pushing... We're holding ourselves off quite nicely, I feel, here. So I'm going to start building a few reactors while I've still got the energy. I'm just thinking about a nine. Let's try again what we've got there. I'm still in line, something else to finish building. Ten. Currently getting eleven. Okay, eleven. I won't push it much more. I'll let these build. As you can see, these bits go doop, doop, doop. But these bits are going whom, 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 whom. Right, our ore mine is now getting us ore and sticking it back into our little home base or our B&Q or whatever your favourite one is and that's a lovely thing that we definitely want we've got a collector out to this and this line will be defended actually I should have collectors running along the back here that would be a useful useful thing to have actually connecting them up would be really really extra useful let's connect those two like that there we go and then one in the middle there Alright, those volcanoes are going to be absolute asses to kill. Although, I did get the, uh, the strafer. Let's build a strafer and see what happens when I build a strafer. 
put it over there because it didn't seem to want anything in particular. Uh, although I will continue to build it. I will over get energy in this game. I guarantee that I will be over... If you've played this before, you'll be like, Why are you getting so much energy? Because I'm panicking. I like to have too much rather than too little. That's why I'm fat. <laughs> and minus 15, we're pulling a little bit too much. Is there anywhere we're particularly sucking? Now, that line is being held nicely. We're holding it off here. Yeah, we're holding this big flob off. And the modder everything's holding there. We got our first strafer. Here's our strafer. Okay, so if I click on that... I've just clicked on that. That's all that that's done. Oh, no, it says it's clicking on the thing. What's it? Oh, it's... Ah, now it's getting ammoed. Okay, shit. Let's relay it. Okay, relay me. Close up. Relay. Relay. What's the relays? But the, the the bits to build the relay can travel down the relays that you're currently building. There it goes. Right, so that's got full ammo, and away it goes. Okay, so as well as having missiles and that, we also could build units. The enemy can also fire units like this at you. It's always a good idea to watch out. Here he goes, here goes Speed Strafer. He's a demon on wheels. Oh, Very nice. Auto launch of target set. So he's going to just basically go around and blam the everything. I probably quite like it if you took on... I said to take on that one, but that I don't think is the big problem. I think this currently is our big problem. So I'd rather he went and helped us bomb this one. Yeah, that would be nice. Oh, it says if we tick a thing, does that attack a circle around that area? Yeah, he'll just then attack anything in that. <laughs> he'll just go ape shit at that point. Bang, 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 bang. Yeah, okay. Cool, we'll just let him do his thing over there. Alright, I'm gonna grab... How much am I doing? 16. That's a lot of energy. Decided I want a lot more. So, uh, these are all... This is a nice safe space I'm building right here. 13, 14, ooh, 15. It's not getting any more. Gonna murder my own energy. I love watching all the little bits happen. I love how, because you can zoom in, I haven't just haven't done that yet. I don't complicate these networks get really quickly, but they're just... Just filling it in. Just doing its thing. Right. You gotta be... You wanna move things forward as well. You wanna be able to basically leapfrog over yourself. That's the strategy that I found was working particularly well. Because uh, what you can do... Actually, we'll build one entirely to demonstrate this. We'll build a more so here. I will teach you things. Oh, I will show you such sights. Um, let's also, actually while we're waiting, let's get just another set of relays down and feed into that area. Because you want to have fast communication for everything. Well, that's important. Does he go and restock when he runs out? I didn't know, pay attention last time. I think he does. Yes, he does. Okie dokie. Alright, so now this is done and it's loading up ammo. Once I've clicked on it, as you can see, I can click somewhere and then it will lift up. And it will move to where you've sent it. So it can't fire on that way, but it means that you can actually, instead of having to build, 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 and build lots and lots of guns, you can move your guns forwards as you go. Now we got a fair bit of this stuff, so I'm going to risk a sprayer. I think I can build it right there. So I'm going to have great range. I kind of, with this extra mod, I'm kind of hoping we get to clear a little space out here that I can fit the sprayer into. I think actually we might be able to fit it in. I'm going to risk it. Now the sprayer sprays basically anti-goo. And the anti-goo is very, very useful. Because they can't touch the anti-goo. If, if goo and anti-goo touch, they get destroyed. Actually, the, just the goo gets destroyed. The anti-goo is fantastic. Ground feed it. Power it. It's built and it should start splurging out goo. Actually, it should start then getting the special blue stuff. You'll see the blue. There it is. There goes the blue. Now that guy will then start mining again. Uh, let's get you another relay point. So you don't have to go around. Because that's going... I was rather just went... And was a bit quicker. Ah, there is our anti-goo! Just causing a nice defensive point. Now this is a good point to uh, start putting some things down that you'll find useful. Like so. And then some collectors to attach all that together. You always need the collectors to attach it together. And then if we... if we, we I don't think we're going to run out spray yet. I'm only using one and it seems to be enough. I had fucking four the other man. I wonder if I was losing. <laughs> okay, there we go. And these guys are going to start getting loaded up. Probably be useful if they had another relay. You'll see that it's getting a little bit tangled there. But that's not my deal to keep up with. It's the games. 
If we get that built, then all the ammo should run down to there and then to them. I think that'll be the quickest way for it to go. Let's see if they do Oh, no, I think it's... No, there's some of it is, yeah. Sometimes it is. Right, this guy's here. Now, we've got here a nullifier. Oh, can't build it there. There we go. If we can build it and it gets successfully built, it will target and destroy this. You have to use this. That All it does is destroys these bits. Ooh, we don't have enough firepower down here. Let's try and bring some mortars in around here. Now, these ones here aren't really doing anything, so I'm, instead of just building new ones, I'll start dragging some of these over. At this point, you definitely want to have a good network. Oh, I think... Did I just destroy something? Did I just land? I wasn't paying enough attention. There we go. Really want the guns in front of it, but oh well. As soon as we take this thing over... Life is good again. <laughs> life is structurally secure again, at least. Right, I'm going to just build some more collectors in case those ones destroy. I don't suddenly want to lose the ability to fuel everybody. Right, I think we got enough now to get our nullifier, 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 nullifier... Just keep that going. Actually, I really should probably move you forward a bit, although you'll stop pumping that goo out for a second. Hopefully we'll be alright. Keep the nullifier nullified! Yeah, because once that's destroyed, of course, then you don't have to worry about all the goo that's coming out. You just have to worry about all the goo that's leaking out of these guys. Come on, build the fucking thing, build the thing, build the thing. Oh yeah, I love this fucking thing. It pumps up so cool. Oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a fucking Catherine Wheel of Death. Spin, you circular bastard. And then, laser beam of death. Pop. Very nice. And we have defeated the first little piece of enemy. Hooray! Uh, while that's tidying, we're going to want to build some strafers over here. 20 in, so we could probably build quite a few strafers over here. It's our airport. Okay, let's come around how many said I should have. So I just built more. Okay, and now we will expand out. Now remember, this isn't pumping anything out apart from in the places at the top, so it's slightly less of a threat. We can expand ourselves a little bit more. No, you stay there. You come forwards. Make sure you're all attached, so that's a really important thing. If they're, if they're not attached, they'll just uh, stop when they run out of ammo. So you got to make sure they stay attached. Keep all the lines built. Keep all the relays relaying. As you can see here, that's an extremely long relay because this piece here, whatever you put in this bit here, it's like an amplified super version of. So if I was to put a cannon in there, it would get an extremely large, vicious range of wonderfulness. Don't know how, oh, a beam, by the way, is for shooting down enemy aerials. I don't know what happens if I build a strafer in there. It might be... I don't know, let's find out. Okay. <laughs> if I don't know a thing, I might as well find out the thing. That's how learning works. At least it was back in my day. Kind of want to build it there to get that built, because this is all a bit, you know, shit. Uh, well, it's fine. Maybe they'll be able to defend that well enough for me. That's all being held off. That's all being held off. You can go sit over here. You can come sit over here. You go sit over here. You go sit over there. Probably need some collectors running across here to fuel all these guys. Boop, boop. Alright, we are holding. Yeah, I don't know what the hell comes out of this thing. <laughs> yeah, you actually should probably go and bomb like that. Wait, go bomb that. There we go. Alright, you. How do you bomb things? Let's see what you do, once you've stocked up. So I'm going to send all these guys in and around this area. To clear this out a little bit. Because it's a really hard area to get into, this one. Ah, oh, see, that guy's got double weapons. He's going doobie doobie doobie. These are all got little single ones. He just goes ba ba doo He's vastly superior. Lovely. So we'll start to cull off how all these fire and push ourselves out a little bit more. Nicely done. Nicely done. Nicely done. Let's get the collectors there for when you're there. However, the collectors get the second use of basically just running everything. Like a relay point just to come up here. Um, yeah, I've got one between the relays there. 
Okay, you can forwards. We're watching out. We can't come much further forward. You might have to get a few more down there. You can come over here though. You can come over here though. Okay, as you can see, that's now been brought down to a much more usable, useful level. And with this clear path here, bring this to you out there. Let's see if we can whack a few collectors across this. And up to here, because that's been nullified enough to get us in. A nullifier! Nice. Can I select all of them at once and then turn the bomb somewhere else? Yes, I can. But right now, they're just. Oh, here, they reload real quick. I did not notice they reload that quick. Yeah, you don't have to destroy all of the goo. You just have to destroy the uh, all the basey bits. Although, you do need to pick up all the keys, so you need to destroy quite a lot of the goo in the long run. Let's get some relay points alongside all the collect. I should probably just be using relay points. I don't really need the energy, but... Oh, well. You there, you there. Okay, bombing it. So when that's empty, it'll be fine. All this sludge will just sludge somewhere. And you see, it's not really threatening. It just sort of sits there at this point. That a little bit. Let's bring you over there a little bit. You up there. You over there. You over here. Name collectors all the way along. Nice. Whee! There goes one key. So we can go to another level. Nullifiers nullifying! Oh, you assholes can go bomb that guy. Okay, we can then start to build a few modders around the place. To bomb this last little bit, and then we can put something else in there. I don't know what. I mean, if we put more in there, it gets hella range, but not enough to get the other guy. And yeah, nullifies and stuff get their special range in there as well. Put a relay in there, we get super connections. Right, mortars, come on, bomb it. I need you to empty that thing out. Maybe I'll just buy another super ship. They're doing a really good job, those ships. From here, I'm going to build a few cannon. Okay, come on, keep pushing on, keep pushing on. Push, 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 push. Yeah, nice. And then as soon as it clears out, I'm just going to keep expanding it. Destroy it all. Yeah, that's a very flim and, flim and flimsy layer over there. You up, you forwards. Here, why don't we just build the collectors before we go? Seems like that'd be a good idea. Okay, collectors, collectors. Right, we don't need all these ones that we've got here, so I'm going to take half of them to come down here. Mortar. Mortar. You sit there, hold that line. You go up there. Okay, we've cleared enough of a path to get a collector line through here. One would hope. We can update it with relays. And then, of course, I need nullifier thing here. Oh, actually, we also want to go grab that key. There we go. Lovely jubbly. Although, uh, maybe I'm slightly worried about how this is getting attacked. Uh, I suppose it's just, it's just holding off the area, really. That's what we really need it to do, is just hold off for now. Can't really seem to get rid of this loss a bit. That's pumping out a lot, really quickly. Oh, I didn't build anything in there. Let's get another strafer in there. My next key. Yes. Yes. Fly, you packets, fly! A lot of dirt under my mouse. It's making a grinding feel. I hate that. It's the worst feeling, other than, you know, rollables. No rollables! Ah, oh, well, that's not gonna be good in time. Fire the photon torpedo! Or whatever the fuck that thing is. Pop! Na 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 na! Did it. So, well, apparently that was 8 out of 50 for an award. Maybe there's uh, 50 levels. Well, there's loads of different modes as well. So we've done that one. We can now go do this one. Ormos. Ormos. And we will restart the world. Because this one has a really weird fucking twist to it that I did not appreciate. Uh, what do we got? So, 
I don't know what the hell that is. That looks like an ability. And there's a key. So we've got a rough... Is that a wall? No, I don't know what the blue stuff is. Um, we've got a divot here, so that'll just fill up. We've got a, a high wall. That's a very, very, very high wall there. And then they're really high towers, so they're higher than the wall. And a few little bits of slightly higher terrain there. So we've got a very high wall to defend. So basically we've got to build this energy. Energy? I don't know what that is. Well, uh, okay, so this is going to have to sit in here. My first thing is I want to grab whatever the hell that is. Uh, we'll do sort of like five to start with. Dig in, Ramigan. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Okay, build that. We'll get that and find out what that is. Looks like maybe it's a wall. Maybe we can just block in gaps. So you see on this level immediately there's a big fucking typhoon of water coming in. There's a tsunami of sludge. Simon's one of the resource packs and Greek will give you energy on this map. On other maps, other resources may be available. Ah, so it's a five and it clumps onto these. To steal energy. I'm guessing just at once. First siphon! Nice. So we've got, as you can see, an absolute shit ton of stuff coming in, but we will have 75 energy as our bonus. Nice. Okay. We. You can build turps to terra from land. Build around five turps now, spread them out near the edge of the old ruins. I don't know what you do. Oh shit. Turp! Turp! Turp. I do not know what these do. These cost a lot. But I got I got a lot of energy that I'm hoping come in to pay for all this. Hey, anyway, that's sort of working. Okay, right. All this shit, all this shit is mine. All this shit is mine. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Okay, negatives. Big negatives. Energy is running super critically negative. Come on, do you got mother grab that one yet? Collect it. Hooray! So that's like a one time is that a one time deal? Oh, it just drains it away slowly. I oh, thought it would just give it to me all at once. Drains it away slowly. But it's kind of giving us things. So that means that this network is going to collapse. Click the terraform button and then basically paint where to change the terrain. Nearby turps will magically act on nearby terrain. Select a brush size of one. What? Wait, I could just fill in this wall. Oh, that's awesome! So I can literally, from assuming a shit ton of energy, just build big feckin' walls to keep everything safe. While I sort out what I'm doing with the rest of the world. <laughs> okay then. Nice. Oh, I hope I build them in time. Nice. Okay. Wow. So there's terraforming as well in this game. Yeah, fuck it. Of course there is. Why not? Well, I need to teleport to the top of the bottom. But that'll be a thing. Siphon depleted. Oh, that means that's going to stop. Oh, shit. Well, also, it might mean that I was only really sucking energy away from one of them at a time. I was. Delightful. Right, what I definitely need is some fucking relays to get the energy to these fuck sticks faster. Nice. And then energy, energy, energy. Tasty energy for everybody. That siphon's depleted. Siphon? Yes, the siphon. Quick, keep building the things. Okay, good. Oh, no, wait. So I could I could terraform uh, all that along there as a tent. And I can just teleport a line. Oh no, but there's nothing there to do that one. I need to build this. Oh, okay. So I can now defend myself from the evil aliens. So that's a height of seven at the moment. Oh, so the ten is the plan. Oh, and then when it builds it, it becomes a ten. Right, gotcha. Okay, good. So oh, so what I could also do then. If I put the brush size up, say like that, and let that guy go to work, oh, eventually if I've got the power for it, yeah, I really need some reactors, don't I? Let that guy go to work, yeah, because when these things are gone, then I'm absolutely fucked. Uh, I can then build places to fire from, so I'm going to be firing from places in this map. Okay, what's the height of this water? Off, literally off the scale. 23. Ah, piss. So I'm only safe up to this line of water here, and then it's too high for me again. So I've got to be ready to attack it. Uh, oh, maybe I can't actually build where creep is, by the look of it, actually. Hang on, if I build like that... Ah, oh, shit, I can't build where creep is. Okay. 
That ain't good. Build around yourselves, build around yourselves. Basically just raise me up. Use all the energy, raise me up. And then we can start fighting this thing. I gotta get some fucking reactors in, otherwise I'm just gonna drown. We're losing a lot of energy. I wonder why! Uh, I gotta do some. I can't stop any of this, so we're gonna run low on energy. The network's gonna be angry at me. Come on! Absorb! Absorb! You're supposed to take my fall. Oh yeah, it's really absorbing that shit. <laughs> it's sucking that thing away. Okay, well, the shit. I think we've got another one, just to ruin your day. Yeah, that one's built. Okay, 8.1. We need more, we need more. What's... how far are we safe until now? There, that hits 10. So beyond that, death. Deadly death. Uh, spray might be a useful thing to have first. No, we ain't got anything to spray with. Shit, mortars. Just more mortars are good for depth. We just need to tackle on these, literally these first bits. Just literally, just right on their faces. Boom, boom. So much building, so much negative right now. All of the things have gone. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, oh no. Remember, these need to be ten, because these are nine walls, and the only way to see... I've, although I'm building mortars, I don't actually need... I don't need to build these walls, thinking about it. You know what? It kept me alive, but I'm going to say now, let's get the mortars going. We'll build the flat paths we need to, because I'm not building any thingies apart from mortars. I'll probably need to build more later. For now, mortars, 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 mortars. Also, oh shit, I need it. reactors. I need reactors so bad right now. You have no idea. I'm in so many negatives. There we go. The mortars are making a dent in it, at least. What's your height currently? Three. Coming up to four. What about you? Right the thing there. Only two, because you're bombing the shit out of it. Nice! Now, when this reactor starts, we should be able to get a nice push towards... Oh, I've realised there's a hole here. So this game features, yeah, terrain deformation, destruction. Is anything actually pumping out water? I couldn't actually see. Are you? No. I might have to just grab the key. Not entirely sure. However, oh, that looks like we're now holding off the typhoon of water a little bit. Although now it is hitting... Oh, is it going down? Oh, I think it's going down. I think that was it. I think that's the onslaught done. Come on, build, 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 build. That is built. Getting in 8.0. We're just gently losing it. Gently running on negatives. Uh, if I click that one, it's going to start really screwing me up. I should build this right off the fucking quick thingy. God, there's only so much an ammo, so much an ammo, so much an ammo. You don't take anything while you're sitting there, do you? Let's find out. No. Shit. <laughs> that was a complete fucking waste. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. I'm doing fucking long videos recently. I do apologise. I think you all haven't got time with it. Some games take longer to show off everything they do. I don't know what everything this does. It just added terraforming. Okay, now we another one there. Bloop. Because that one's about to finish. And hopefully it'll bring me into a much happier 9.3. Okay, we're now gaining even while building this thing. We are holding back the Tsunami of Sadness. Which is only a 17 on this side and a 16 on this side. We shall overcome. We'll probably overcome anyway. But good odds on us overcoming. Yes, there we go. Energy up, energy up. The network will be healthy again. It's going white. That means it's healthy. White things are healthy. Like the sun. It's pretty white. It's yellowy. It's got sunglasses on. Why does the sun need to wear sunglasses? The fucking sun. What's it shooting size from us? I have questions in my head. That's not one of them. I just wonder how they don't melt. We can make so much cool stuff out of that. Right. Let's extend that collector over. Boing, 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 boing. Nowhere else really to put a collector for a quick bit of income. Maybe just there? I don't think I need two. We could probably risk a few out here. Oh, shit. To get fragments of income. They get destroyed. Meh. 
There we go. And then, yeah, just grab some fucking dust, mate. Grab some dust. And then just a cannon. A cannon should be enough to hold these things off. Cannon here is off. Okay, 12 in. We're getting 8 in before. That's great, Grease. Or is it 11? <laughs> Absolutely no clue. Uh, but we. Oh, no. Structure. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're gonna start losing it there. Oh, when that's built, we should be. Oh shit, there's another one. Well, we should be right eventually, anyway. Everything works out right in the end. There we go. And that guy can now fire and defend that side. Sweet. That should all hold. We probably could do with a mortar here. What height are you running at now? Fifteen. That is gradually decreasing. The height changed dramatically around there. I think it's just like hitting it and flooding round. Interesting. Another one. Come on, more reactors, more reactors. This is our big weakness. Putting two at a time now, two at a time now. Can we do two at a time? I think we do two at a time now. We're going to build two at a time. Aces, Charles, aces. Why don't we just build them like literally on the fucking thing? I don't know. It would be quicker, wouldn't it? Alright, we can hold the flood down. So I'm guessing this is a world where the creeps just it's kind of expanded in places. It's branching out, it's doing new things. One, two, going for three. Oh, that one's off center. Oh, no one likes to see that. All right, we can actually start getting some more weapons and push back in. I want to build maybe another 60 reactor. <laughs> Or thereabouts. Slightly worried that this might flood in. No oh, well. Alright. One, two, three. Three more in there. I don't know how this went past my mind. How this escaped my glance. My seductive glance at Steam. It really, I don't, I don't, this is literally my kind of thing. Fourth one in there. That was going through the route. I wonder if that's actually going faster because it's going pium pium. Don't know. Yeah, I just I was looking through. I want to fancy new RTS, and I saw this. It was like overwhelmingly positive. A game you've never heard of. And I went, what? How is that a thing? And I found it, it was pretty awesome. All right. I don't actually know how to beat this level. I, I'm guessing somewhere under all this shit, there's emitters. Or something to blow up. I think it doesn't just run, although it does seem to be just running out. Maybe we just gotta hold the fort for as long as possible. Maybe we could build like a thousand reactors and really just kick the shit out of it. I don't know. Those explosions sound exactly like the ones from um, Sonic Spinball. It's one of those sound effects that just sounds. There's a really. What's the sound effect? Oh, there's the, the glass breaking sound effect. Is it when you break a window that sounds like you just it's this what it's the sound effect whoops built too many of those I'm gonna flash in red because I'm using all my energy so everyone's gonna be firing slower that's because I decided oh I, they didn't finish building I just literally carried on building oh right, it's fine that makes sense why that went wrong I thought I was dying for a second yeah there's like a glass breaking effect from um, I remember hearing it first in like Rainbow Six Rogue Spear and then it's just, you just hear it literally everywhere. Like, I think Half-Life has the same one. Actually, Half-Life is a very distinct sound effect. If you hear a Half-Life sound effect everywhere, you hear it everywhere. Um, sorry, I need to leave that open. I've just left that sitting there the whole time. Strafers might be a good idea, just to bomb the shit out of terrain. Let's see what we're missing. All right, look at this. Now we're getting some reactors in there. That was a problem, but only for a very short while. Let's build just a wadge of them. I mean, if it fired a big tsunami of water at me, I can do it again. Whoops, too much. <laughs> Build a tiny pavlov, no money. Ooh, there we go, that's a bit too much. Well, it seems to be, it's actually, oh, I'm sitting on the level there. 22.3 in, 22.34 out. I'm not, I'm not complaining about that. I mean, I think it just levels pretty much where you are, but you know what I mean. So it's firing out a lot of shit right now. It's got a lot to do. And when they're done, I think that'll be me for reactors. And I can start bombing the shit out of it. Get some strafers. Strafers might actually lock on if there's something under there uh, that's keeping, that keeps kicking water out. 
Cute. There's some places we want mortars first. Here, it's one. Here, there's another. Here, it's definitely one. Oh no, we want one here. Okay, and then like another 50 in various places. We will then move out. And we'll get some collectors ready. In some more aggressive position. Like so, like so, like so. This bit, yeah. Could have bombed a lot more there. Nice! That's, uh, is that all been built? Oh no, no building. I don't know why it's costing me so much. There we go, now we're feeling it. Okay, let's push you forwards a little bit. Push you forwards a little bit. Oh, there we go. Now the thought, keep on fighting. Okay, now we will... Actually, we, I kind of feel like we do need more... Just cannons scattered around these parts. Because the moors are good for depth, but the cannons... Well, you got single fire, you want cannons. A single layer of their stuff. You want a cannon it. There you go, build all that. Probably go well. Okay, and then let's build this entire little base here. Anything goes wrong. Ooh, that's a risky one down on a one. It's always the risky one. I also would like to have a relay here. And can I literally I built so many factories next to it, I oh thingies I can't actually get a relay even close to it. Ah well I'll do. Relay, I didn't need you in the Oh, you complete uses as well, bye! safer than I have to deal with that shit. Lovely, and we're keeping all our energy going. Here's some collectors around you and around you, so you can begin your push forwards. Little pushes, little pushes. There we go, right, mortars. Advance! Advance? Advance! Yes. Actually, the mortars can go in the little divity bits. I would trust them. Nice. Very nice. You're going to become a part of this. Okay. Collectors, collectors. We didn't build enough collectors. That's the moral of this fucking game. You've never built enough collectors. Okay, I'm taking on one side to see if there's anything I need to destroy. This side will hold. We'll focus one way. Actually, having another cannon here would be really useful. What's your height right now? Nine! It's only a nine! It's rubbish! Okay. Collectors all the way along here. Collectors staggered all the way along here. Ooh, careful. I don't know how we win this one. I'm very intrigued to see. Because this is on the same level as the bombing one, so it wouldn't be a bombing thing. We're losing some collectors. We're losing some collectors. Gotta get these guys that aren't firing in closer to defend the collectors. They're actually keeping them alive right now. Oh shit! Oh, that's gonna get close. Oh, that was a bit, a little bit too close there. I really need to move the guns before I move the mortars. That's how everything works. I was saying in the live stream for this that this is the first time ever in a video game that a mortar weapon has been useful. Never normally the case. I always gotta remember that things are gonna stop firing if I keep moving them out. Yeah, what are you doing? You got no one to bomb here, mate. Yeah, come on. Front line for you. Yeah, everyone loves being on the front line. <laughs> Have a mortar there. You're all firing. That's good. Okie dokie. You're on the line. Right, I genuinely can't see if there's anywhere we're supposed to be pushing. We'll build collectors along. Infrastructure wise, I think we could do with another relay run. It's just up and down. Light sign, so in fact, maybe a relay run. <coughs> oh, excuse me. There we go. <laughs> I love the, the maps that there's like the spider webs that this thing makes as you're pushing on. I think that's a, such a cool little good thing. Go over. Go forwards. Gently advance. Gently advance. Be more in the middle. Oh, that's a quite an aggressive advance. What you've just done there, my friend. Well, if you feel up to it, I'm not going to stop you. 
Unless I can't stop. Oh, I can only if I can. Can I stop them when they're in midair? I probably can. Forwards. March. Forwards. March. Forwards. March. Forwards. March. Yes. Easy peasy. Oh yeah, well, I don't know why I went this way. If there's shit all to do, we just need to go get that fucking key. So this would have been waste. But then all this shit can fuck off over to this side and it'd be great. Forwards. Forwards, everybody. Consistently forwards. That's what we are now. We're forward thinkers. We only think the word forwards. Very terrible way of thinking. What if you need to think of the word kebab? Or marzipan? Collectors, 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 collectors. Relay expansion. Relay expansion. You just do relays along the front. That's a nice relay grid. That's a good relay grid. If anybody saw that, it was into relay grids, they'd be like, shit. I can now that relay grid, and I'd be like, I know. <laughs> I don't think it's anything to destroy. I think I've completely wasted my time coming this way. Ow, oh, piss. What you got there? Or in there? Is that an innie bit? Yes, that's an innie bit. Yeah, that's an innie. Uh, you're absolutely useless in there. Don't go in there. You go in there. A mortar, though. Mortar could fucking live in there for days. Yeah, you can remove them. I don't know why that guy's going over there. You're over there. Mortar. 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 Alright. Unless it is continuously coming, I think we're going to make this bastard retreat. He's down on an 8 there, but ooh, he's down on fucking... Point four eight here. Ain't got shit left. Ain't got shit left in him, lads. Advance! Dun, 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 dun. All the music's all white. Yeah, fucking Earth. Fuck with Earth for the last... I don't know if Earth's involved in this skirmish. There is a story. I just... Wanted to kill some water. Fuck water, man. Hashtag fuck water. Don't need that. Have you seen this raw water thing that runs into? People are only drinking like water that comes out of swamps and shit. <laughs> I didn't really realize any of this. It's genuinely a thing that's happening right now. People are only drinking raw water. Like it's a like that's a thing that people do. Relays, relays, and relaying all this shit. You got to defend it. Uh, we'll probably be fine. Oh, that won't be fine there, will it? No. Not good enough to defend that. All right, relay that. Really? No, we're there. Oh, fuck. No, oh, that'll do. Relay. Relay. I think we fucked these guys up. Yeah, you know, last little bits, last little bits, last little bits. Alright, I don't think we need the mortars anymore, so mortars, push on! Where are we pushing on to? It's really a fuck all place for you to go at the moment, but push on! All of you. We must fight. We must save the Earth. Or Earth 2, Earth 3. F7, where we're on by this point. How about we move to other planets? We'll just call them like Earth 2. It's just that just sounds like sequels are always crap compared to the first one. I mean never had a comedian a joke. That's the rule. You just you can't do it. It's gonna be have to be a few people are gonna have to risk their lives going in the trenches. Oh you you yeah, literally useless in the trenches. Hmm, where are you gonna go live? Down here? Yeah, fuck it. You can all move down here for now. While we clean out that space. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Front line's moving over. If you could just took this pattern, it seems like it's some sort of pattern of some evil world order. I don't mean to create an evil world order today. Comes all the time, but you're not expecting it. You're not expecting an evil world order and something, bam. You'd create another one. Well, I could actually terraform this land up, couldn't I, if I built, uh... Alright, no, 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 you go you go back to where you were, mate. If I put the terrain onto a height of two... Yeah, you could just terraform us the gap that we need! Yes, and then you guys... You can go land on this newly created land. That's probably safe. Oh, look at that! I selected a few of them. And actually then tried to put them in like the best positions for them. That's fucking cool. I mean some of them are gonna die because they're gonna land on the creeper, but you know what? That's the way of doing it actually. We'll get relays running along the front of our new front line. Oh 
got most of our new front line. Ooh, shit. People are going to start taking damage. There we go. Nicely done. Yeah, we actually managed to clear that bit out. We mostly managed to clear that bit out. I think I landed on my own friend. Oh, well. It's all been there. This bit here is a fucking weakness as shit. You get in there. Can we have just one of you... Over here, maybe. And another cannon. Another cannon pushes forwards. You there. You there. I'm really going to worry about that bit there. Bring you out forwards. Bring you out forwards. Not too many this time. I have to move them all forwards. But I want to. I want to so much. Bum, 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 bum. Oh fuck, it's nearly another fucking hour video. I wanted to make them shorter. Well, people watch longer. I don't know. It's just me. I like short videos, really, I think. Although, if it's a game that I'm like, oh, I want to see all the mechanics of this game, I always watch longer videos on it. Huh. I'm trying to give informed purchases. I want to buy another fucking 2K18 on Switch. Boo! Boo you, Nintendo! Okay, I think we're going to do it right. Oh, we're going to get a relay to connect to that. Ooh, where's the relay need to be there? Oh, actually, no. Ooh. Can we focus, say, you on this bit here? And all of you here. That's the bit we really need to focus on. I can just, like, scoop up your turrets and move them. This is like turtling the game. I'm okay with that. That's what I've always wanted. This is the RTS I've always wanted. Going up against a predictable but vicious AI. That's my one. I just don't like unpredictability. In my real-time strategy, there's titans and shit. Also, apparently you can get more command things. Not any of those do. Okay, there we go. Build the thing. Bloop, 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 bloop. These my victory orbs. Are these my victory orbs? Stop bombing the key, mate. I've got the key. Is that what I have to do? Yes, it was! <laughs> I'm gonna... I could have rushed that, but in like 10 seconds. Well, that's the, uh, that's Creeper World 3. I'll claim a victory. I'll continue with that submitting. So I've unlocked. Oh my god, what is up with that planet? Oh wait, that one's locked. Oh, see, I need to go get the key from this planet. And this planet's gimmick. This planet's difficulty is, this planet is just planet debris.